What's up guys, Chris Schwartz Edmiston from SchwartzEdmiston.com and today we're going to be looking at how to get rid of the little gray bar at the bottom of Brian websites. It's the easiest way immediately when I see a website and I see this little gray bar, I know that people are using the Brian template. So today I want to show you guys how to get rid of it because it's annoying, it covers up the content on the screen and it's a dead giveaway for the Brian template. So there's two ways to do it. The first is just to go into the style editor and go into mobile view and click on that bottom bar. And what you can do is just set the background to transparent. And now as I scroll down, you can see content is no longer getting cut off by the little gray bar. And I think that's a fine solution. The only problem with it that I can see is that it's still there, it's still covering the content, it just has a transparent background. So if somehow someone got a link that they wanted to click perfectly underneath that bar, they wouldn't be able to click on it because they would actually just be clicking on the transparent bar instead of the link itself. So I also want to share a code solution with you guys. Um, so actually I'm going to set this back to full opaque color and I'm gonna go to my custom CSS and if we inspect this element we're gonna see that it has two classes it has mobile bar and mobile bar bottom and the reason it's showing up you can see it's highlighted in green is because it even when you don't populate anything like your cart icon or your search icon in the bottom bar it still has this padding of 8 pixels on the top and 8 pixels on the bottom so all we have to do is target these classes and set the padding to zero. So I'm going to say mobile bar dot mobile bar bottom padding zero. Whoops, I didn't use curly brackets. Make sure you use curly brackets. Got to hold that shift button, and now you can see it immediately goes away. So that's a much cleaner solution because nothing is actually covering up anything on the page the bottom bar has fully disappeared so I encourage you guys to drop this code in on your website it'll take like one second and I think it really cleans up the layout because your content won't be covered up by that annoying little gray bar at the bottom thank you guys again if you have any questions or comments go ahead and visit my website you can send me an email or leave a comment down below please subscribe to the channel. It's brand new. I'm going to have a ton of content to help you guys out and help you guys create better Squarespace websites. Thanks.